Greetings everyone, Jim here from Storm Warning News with an alert regarding a U.S. unmanned MQ-9 aircraft having contact with Russian aircraft today. This is a statement from U.S. European Command, which was just released a short time ago, and it goes as follows. Two Russian Su-27 aircraft conducted an unsafe and unprofessional intercept with a U.S. Air Force Intelligence, Surveillance, and Reconnaissance unmanned MQ-9 aircraft that was operating within international airspace over the Black Sea today. At approximately 7.03 a.m. Central European time, one of the Russian Su-27 aircraft struck the propeller of the MQ-9, causing U.S. forces to have to bring the MQ-9 down in international waters. Several times before the collision, the Su-27s dumped fuel on and flew in front of the MQ-9 in a reckless, environmentally unsound, and unprofessional manner. This incident demonstrates a lack of competence in addition to being unsafe and unprofessional. Our MQ-9 aircraft was conducting routine operations in international airspace when it was intercepted and hit by a Russian aircraft, resulting in a crash and complete loss of the MQ-9, said U.S. Air Force General James B. Hacker, Commander, U.S. Air Forces Europe and Air Forces Africa. In fact, this unsafe and unprofessional act by the Russians nearly caused both aircraft to crash. U.S. and Allied aircraft will continue to operate in international airspace, and we call on the Russians to conduct themselves professionally and safely, Hecker added. The incident follows a pattern of dangerous actions by Russian pilots while interacting with U.S. and Allied aircraft over international airspace, including over the Black Sea. These aggressive actions by Russian aircrew are dangerous and could lead to miscalculation and unintended escalation. Well, my friends, we will see what comes of this. Perhaps escalation was intended. I mean, seemingly this seems like a, a situation that wouldn't amount to much, but at this current time, with the amount of tension in that area of the world, uh, with NATO uh, fighting its... Uh, proxy war with Russia through the Ukraine, this could potentially, potentially develop into something very significant and very serious. We will see how this goes. And please remember, the word of God is written in Proverbs chapter 29, verse 25, which says, the fear of man lays a snare, but whoever trusts in the Lord is safe. Trust in Jesus, my friends, with everything you have. This is Jim signing off. Until the next time, God bless you.